what's up gang welcome back to my channel thank y'all so much for coming back and showing me some love um i did see i got a lot of new subscribers welcome to my channel enjoy the gang um today i'm bringing y'all a little something different i will be doing a skincare routine um normally honestly i'm everything i'm about to open is coming right out of the box i never used these products before yet um i really want to try it out i don't have a normal skincare routine that i do do normally i just wash my face with this and then just put coconut oil on there but it's not working for me um but yeah before we get into this video please like comment subscribe turn your post notification on so you get notified every time i upload a video and yeah let's get into the video give a damn about a hater when i feel like it not today, not today, not today, not tomorrow. Get out my way, please. I'm trying to get paid. But y'all, yeah, growing up, I never really had an issue with my skin. I never had acne. I mean, I may, may get one pimple here and there, but for the most part, my skin growing up was extremely clear up until, I want to say, after I had my fourth child. Yeah, it had to been after I had my fourth child. This was in 2019. That's when my face really started breaking out. I honestly don't know if it's, I either got eczema or psoriasis on my face. I don't know if y'all can see, but after when I was pregnant with my son in 2019, I'm trying to look at it. All right here, it started to get like real scaly and then it came right here. Can y'all see it? It's not as bad as it was before because when I did go to the dermatologist, they had gave me, matter of fact, it's right here. They had prescribed me this. And honestly, when I use this every day, it do stop with the inflammation, the redness on my face. But as soon as I, um, as soon as I stop using it, then the redness come back. And I don't, I need to just try something like some type of other products besides that because it's it, it works but once i stop using it then it flare up again and it's in my hair as well don't mind my hair because i'm about to throw a wig on it but um i was last night i was actually on youtube um watching a lot of like skincare routines and what should i do and yesterday i when i went to walmart i picked up a couple of stuff i never used this i hope it is good um I got is by nature vitamin C is the face wash. I got the serum, um, the moisturizer, and the face oil. What actually made me go on YouTube and really like look at products? I'm like, what's the difference between serum and oil? Like, should, I, I wasn't sure if I should get both of them or one or the other, but they did say it was two different. Um, they both was different. They like not the same thing. So. As I was watching a bunch of videos, I watched so many videos. One thing, everybody kept saying, oh, you need to exfoliate. Even like I'll be watching some dermatologist video. They say it, exfoliating is good for like getting the dead skin off or whatever. And I didn't know under, I didn't know what type of skin I had. Um, I, knew my, I know I got dry skin, but as I was watching videos, basically I got textured skin because sometimes I do. I don't know if y'all can see it. I got like little bumps. Like right now, for or is it? Do I got oily skin? Cause it do feel oily. I didn't even wash my face today yet. So I'm, I don't know. I know I got textured skin, cause it's like bumps and I don't. Know, my face is uneven and I hate it. So we need to correct that. So I was, I actually last night three o'clock in the morning, I went on Sephora and DoorDash a couple of stuff that I didn't have. So. this was good for like um exfoliating and it was another one i forgot the other brand if i um when i google when i look when i'm gonna google it and then i'm gonna put it on top of here it was another brand i was in between should i get this one or this one but i was looking at the derm the dermatologist video and he had both of them on he had this one and the other one i had seen but i'm like this one got more of maybe what I need in it and I don't know I'm gonna just try it and if I don't like it I'm gonna go to the other one but I had got a bunch of stuff well not a bunch of stuff just I may have paid $40 for this I think it was like $40 but I just got like some pads or whatever but y'all let's get into this um skincare routine and I'm gonna take y'all along with me to see how my face works I'm gonna actually I'm gonna do this 
um every morning every night for a week straight and then i'm gonna come back and let y'all know how my face turned out but hopefully because i spent a lot of money it was it wasn't that much but like i know i spent 70 dollars on all four of these so hopefully that this do work i don't know it say it's vitamin c i know they say vitamin c is good for um texture skin and um psoriasis i don't know if it's psoriasis or what i got i need to go back to the dermatologist and see but um but yeah we're gonna start off and then another thing i did i was confused with another reason why i was watching so many videos because i didn't know which one come first i thought you um cleanse your face first and then put the moisturizer on in the serum but no you so you cleanse your face first and then you put the exfoliator on for about 15 10 or 15 minutes you wash it off and then use the serum this is the serum the face serum then the most moisturizer so i seen a lot of sunscreen and everything i didn't get it that's what i need to get but after that then i'm gonna just do the face oil but honestly in one of the um dermatology man video he said really because i'm like this is a lot of stuff that really, people really put on their face can do you really need all that and he was saying the only thing really really that you need to do put on your face is of course cleanse exfoliate and then moisturize that's it everything else is really irrelevant to be honest but for this video or well, for my skin because my skin is horrible we're gonna do every last single one of these products and i'm gonna do it morning and night and i'm gonna let y'all know how it go let's get into this video first i'm gonna wash my face really good hold on y'all and they said they use blue wrong water when I'm washing my face, honestly, I use hot water, but I know that's not good, so I'm going to really start, I've been neglecting my, neglecting my face, and that's probably why it got this bad. I mean, I wash my face every day, but I don't do the necessary steps to take, to clear my fucking, to, to, sorry, to clear my skin, so we're going to do this in this order. I'm going to wet my face first. That's what we're going to do. Wet it first, and I got. It. Matter of fact, I need to get these fucking my lashes, y'all. How you like my lashes? I got them on Amazon, but it's a lot of freaking glitter and it's all on my face. Let me get that off. But ah, uh, got what am I? I like these little pads because I could just use that. All right, so I am going to let me show y'all. See, I legit just bought it yesterday, actually. And I was waiting. I'm glad I did watch some videos because I did not know anything about exfoliating at all. Like, I seen people, they use toners and all this extra stuff. I didn't want to get that because I don't know really. I don't know. But it's cream cleanser. It's a by nature from New Zealand. Vitamin C, brighten and hydrate. Cream cleanser. Remove makeup and impurity with boost of vitamin C. What's the ingredients? And it's a vegan friendly too. So let's see what the show you what the bottle look like. But yeah, it's a lot of ingredients in here. If y'all wanna um go check it out. Um I got this from Walmart. So you have to check out the ingredients. But let's put this on my skin. Mm. And it smells good. I really didn't want nothing with a fragrance. But that just might be the just the vitamin C. It smells just like mm. it smells so good. It smells just like oranges. But let's just put this everywhere. I'm not sure how I like this texture though. I wanted something like soapy. Let me see. Cream cleanser. I'm gonna wet my brush a little bit. Let's see. Mmm. I don't know. I might have to find a different cleanser. I don't know how I feel about this. Cause it feel like lotion. I wanted something that like I 
thick and soapy. Oh, gosh, I'm gonna go back on Sephora and look at what they got. Wait, wait. See, the only thing is, I be seeing a lot of people that um, a lot of these stuff they do for their skincare routine is like different brands. But me, being so that I don't really know what to use or really works for my skin, I wanted to stay in the same brand. I wanted everything to be from one brand. Um, but it looks like that I will have to find another You see, apply to damp face, massage gently in the skin, avoid eye contacts, rinse well, pat dry. I'm not liking it. I don't know how I feel about this. We're going to see. I don't want to judge too soon, but I need something that leather my face up. This just for like lotion. Yeah, it's giving lotion. But we're going to see how this go. All right, so I'm about to wash my face real quick, and I'll be right back. I'm back. I just washed my face. Um, It's still a little wet, so I'm going to pat dry it. Y'all see um how my face got red? My face is so sensitive. Well, I mean, let me see. Yeah, it's right. It's so sensitive, so I hope these products don't, like, flare my skin up. Oh, we gonna see but that and that probably could be too because i'll be washing my face too hard so i need to like be real gentle but i want it to be fully dry before i put this next one on all right you guys so my face is dry now and i'm gonna go ahead and go in um with the exfoliator from ordinary say the ordinary let me see how it's focusing. I can't see. And it's lactic acid, 10% a high strength lactic acid, superficial pill and form formulation. Uh, it's got a lot of ingredients. I don't want to read all the ingredients, but it's basically lactic acid. And I believe that is for dry to sensitive skin. Now let's read that. Where is the actual box? Let me read this real quick. So how to use it or directions. It say apply once per day, but really you really only supposed to do it um once once the two one or two times per week, not every day. Apply once per day. Ideal in the PM can be diluted with other treatments to reduce strengthen until skin develops tolerance. Do not use on sensitive peeling or could promise skin, but I thought this was for skin sensitive skin or is it for dry skin. Avoid contact with eyes, contact the product with the skin must be limited frequently or dilution. Use only as directed pet tests. Okay, so we're gonna use this. I'm gonna do a squirt right here. Oh, I'm scared. I don't know what. And then I'm gonna lather this in. Should I do it with my hands or I'm gonna do it with my hands? Oh, I love the way that feel. I don't know if I put enough on. So don't get it like near your eyes. Oh, ooh, that. Why that burn right there? Ooh, I don't know if I should use this. Hold up. I'm only going to use a little because, oh, 
do I got a bump right there? Oh, I might got a sore right there. That's why it burned. Oh, let me not, let me break that off. Oh yeah, it burned right there. I don't like that. Alright, so we're gonna leave this on for about five to ten minutes and then I'm gonna wash it off. So I'll be right back. And with I have to get it open. It's a brighten and hydrating face serum. And it got vitamin C in it. It say hydrate face serum will get your natural glow back with brightening vitamin C and firming and plumping. And it got um, turmeric extract in it. So we're gonna put a little bit of that, dab of that. Then we're gonna, yeah, work that in. Why is it over there? Oh. But yeah, let me um put this in. It's kind of all. Is it supposed to be sticky, y'all? Y'all, comment down below and let me know um, what products I should use. Like, if this don't work for me, can y'all recommend me, like, products I should use for my textured skin and it's dry? Like, I'll have Ricky like this. I don't even know. How will look now, though? I mean, it make my face look, I don't know. All right, y'all, now I'm gonna go in with the moisturizer. It do say, oh, they all say brighten and hydrate. Why didn't I look at that? I think I'm gonna have to get something else. For real, it say face and body. Energize and replenish. What's this one say? Energize and replenish dull skin. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and with the moisturizer. I think I put too much on y'all. Did I? Yo, I don't know how I feel about this product. Y'all think it's an L? Hmm. Do y'all? Let me know. Let me just all in. I swear, when I be watching these videos, they face just be looking so bright. So like shiny and oily and moisturized. I need to do this with my lashes off. I mean it feel it feel alright. Okay. All 
All right, I'm gonna let that work in my skin. See, the one thing um, why I hate watching like um, skincare routines because they be putting it on back to back. As soon as they one come on, they put another one on. You're supposed to let that shit work in your skin. Like you're supposed to let it absorb everything. You're not supposed to just put it on. I I honestly feel like all this is too much to put on your face, but. What do I know? I don't know nothing about these products. But I'm going to let this seep in my skin for another five minutes. And then I'm going to move on to the next step. All right, y'all. So for the last step, I'm going to go in with the face oil. Let me show I'm recording. All right. So um, it's a two to three drops. It's a vitamin C plus turmeric. And this is what it looks like. Hopefully the, the light is not messing it up. But the, ooh, ooh, I'm a dick. I don't know why I thought that it. Wait. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, that's cute. So there's a little pump at the top. I'm gonna go in. My son crying. Can y'all hear him? Right. I'm coming, boy. y'all y'all seen it before and this is the after i like this oil i'm gonna do this in the morning as well now i'm gonna do it at night twice a day and i'm gonna let y'all know how it goes so y'all seen how my skin was before and now it's all hydrated and moist and this is the after all right hope y'all like this video until next time, I'll see you on the next video.